Um, when you're ready. Hi, I'm Claire McMahon Harvey from Careers and Placements. And I am faculty employee ability manager for the Arts and Humanities. And I've worked very closely with Channel 4 and Screen Yorkshire to bring this challenge back. Uh, one of the reasons for that is that as a Careers and Placements department, we want to really help students to develop their skills, to connect with employers, and to be able to develop the skills that are needed in the industry. So from our work with Channel 4, we realised that there's a skills shortage in production coordination and production management, and they were really interested in supporting a programme where we could help students to develop those skills, to work together in a team, um, and then to be able to reflect on that and realise what they can offer the industry. questioning your place in the industry after university or where you want to go next this is really good to kind of help shape your career path potentially and uh, for me personally because I love production and production management. Like this being able to kind of understand budgeting and actual or like planning of a project that's realistic so using all the theoretical skills I've learned in my course and being able to use it in a practical way and also learning where I may not know things like the the experts are in, are insanely knowledgeable and they just come around and they go well you could do this a bit different which is insanely useful So today they're really um, doing some work on research and how to find guests, contributors, but also kind of you know what your content is going to is going to be in a particular program. It's real hands-on experience, and then they're also getting really down to the nitty-gritty of budgets, which are really important because you need to come in and budget and make sure that you can you know make the program that you want to make. Uh, you know, with the budget that you've got, so they're really getting into the nitty gritty of what everything costs line by line, which is really important. Well, it's it's so much easier to work in a team than it is to work on your own. When you're working on your own, you know, um, the ideas don't flow as well. So the great thing is, if you have like six or seven people at your table, you can suggest an idea, and they can say, "Yeah, that's great, but why not do it this way?" So really, you bounce off each other, and it's really much more productive to work in a team. The main thing, advice for students taking part in this is to make the most of it and have a go at all of the different tasks that are on offer um, because that's the best way to learn is by doing. Um, generally for students overall um, who are interested in getting into the industry is say yes to anything you possibly can. Don't just pigeonhole yourself too early. Just be open to absolutely any opportunity that comes up because it's all about this industry is getting some experience and building your networks and contacts. And you can't do that by pontificating. You've got to get involved. challenge at the University of York with some of your students and they spent the week pulling together some ideas for how they would run a show about Vikings for Channel 4. Uh, so they pulled together budgets and today we've been able to see them present their ideas which has been absolutely brilliant. We've been blown away by what they've come up with and how different they all were as well. So it's been a really good thing to do. There's a big shortage of people working in production in our industry so we're really keen for people to consider it as a career path. So it's been fantastic. I think uh, keep putting yourself forward for opportunities like this, I know that this was an optional thing so it's a really good sign that people have signed up for it and if you graduated soon, start getting your CV out there, um, I'm sure you do want a bit of a summer break but I know it takes a while to get off the ground, so start firing it out there, don't be nervous, just reach out to anyone, reach out two or three times as well, nobody minds. 
Um, and yeah, just just do a bit of research as well. Look on websites like Screen Skills, look at the Four Skills website about opportunities that we've got coming up. And just be confident and go chase your dreams. It's uh, totally doable to work in television. We're here, we're in Leeds, uh, we're working all over the country. So it's not this closed off industry that it might have felt like in the past. You can do it, so just go for it.